of this organization, the late David John Howard Thompson, was subjected to the most virulent abuse by a gentleman who is supposed to be the candidate for the Barbados Labour Party in the constituency of St. Michael's South. Now, during David's lifetime, this man used to claim that David was his very good friend. Of course, I am old enough to know, and I was older than David, that you really can't have genuine friends in the Barbados Labour Party. But that he could stand up on a platform in Hero Square and say the things he said about a man who can't defend himself, a man whose spouse, whose wife, is, whose widow is a member until Parliament was dissolved yesterday of the Parliament of Barbados, a man who left three fine young daughters who still have to live and move and have their being in Barbados. And in the face of all of that, he could hold that man up to the claim of abuse and ridicule, which has been reported to me. That is a matter for the profoundest possible regret. It is a matter which I deprecate because from the time I was a second former at the Boys Foundation School, they taught me something that went like this. De mortuis nil nisi bonum. When you are talking about the dead, say nothing but good. But that gentleman has not learned that. And I did not, I don't mind. I don't mind his attacking me because he went into Christ Church East recently as well and launched a blistering attack on me in Christ Church East as well I'm running up there. What did he say about me? He said I am black. But that's a fact. I am black and I am proud. I have never wished it to be anything else. I'm a proud black man. My father was a black man. My mother was a black woman. So what color does he, does he expect me to be? He's a boy, to be a girl. He said, according to reports reaching me, that my nose is broad. Broad or narrow, broad or narrow, is mine. <laughs> and I am very particular as to what I allow my nose to smell. But he said it again up there. He said I'm ugly. <laughs> now, I go across Barbados. I mingle with people of all ages, of all races, of all classes. I talk to girls young, middle aged in the Democratic Labour Party and outside of the Democratic Labour Party and not one of them has ever said to me you know Frondo I think you are ugly
also, he does not have any allies. He stands out tonight, therefore, as the only woman in Barbados who thinks that I am ugly. I am a dumb Adam. And they were behaving yesterday as though this is the first time you see it ever happened. <laughs> Let me tell you this. I don't. Arthur has done it too. But. Arthur is no role model for me in politics. So I really don't care what he does or how he does it. I follow the best examples available to me. 